subscribe to hear what happened on the last episode of Dinosaur Patrol. It's an earthquake! Whoa! Patrol, it's me, Dr. Madison Taylor from the Dino Institute for Kids. It's not an oak earthquake. It sure was. It was a really big earthquake. We have to make sure that doesn't happen again. Have you guys ever heard of global warming or climate change? What's that? Well, climate change is what happens when global temperatures rise and melt the polar ice caps. This creates elevated sea levels, which adds more moisture to the air. We were collecting data and doing our research. There's a good chance that sometime soon there's gonna be a really bad tornado and a volcano eruption. We can't let that happen! We need the Dinosaur Patrol to go on a couple of missions. How about you, Dinosaur Squad? Are you ready for this? Good luck, Dinosaur Patrol. We're counting on you. We are! We are! Dinosaur Patrol! Okay, Dark Tour Patrol, your first mission is to stop a prehistoric volcano from erupting. Our system located the volcano at the old retired army base. All mission kits have been sent and delivered. So get your bus over there and find the mission kit and radio in the answers. I'll be here waiting and we'll input the data to activate the blaster. Good luck, Dinosaur Patrol. Captain Chaseman, I can't believe it, it's a real live volcano. Oh no, we have to do something to stop it. Captain Chaseman, I guess global warming is serious. It's always kind of coming, just look at that volcano. How are we gonna stop it, Captain Jason? We have to find the missing kids that Dr. Madison Taylor sent here. That's right, Captain Jason. We have to find those kids and activate that blast. Wait, what are we waiting for God to come in? This volcano is gonna soon erupt. Let's do this, Captain Jason. Main energy supply, check. Water pipes, wow, no cracks. Whew. dodged a bullet on this one. Dr. Taylor, it's Dino Dad. I'm at Dinosaur Patrol HQ. I just checked out all the dinosaur parks, Site A, Site B, and Site C. All checked out fine, no damage. <laughs> we lucked out on this one. The boys headed off to the army base. They'll be in touch with you as soon as they find those mission kits. In the meantime, I'll be here. If you need me, please call me. Captain Chaseman, I think the missing kits are somewhere in this abandoned house. I don't think we should go in here. It looks abandoned. I think if it's abandoned, things will break. Huh. Abandoned in the house, my goodness. Spooky ghosties. There's no such thing as ghosties. I know, I know, it's not an abandoned house. That means it's like old and, and a lot of it broken parts. Well, we can't stop global warming by sitting here. Let's go. Captain Coleman, it's Dino Dad. This is Captain Coleman, over. Where are you guys? We're in an abandoned house in, in an old army base that, that was shut down a long time ago. Is that where the volcano's located? Uh, yes. Is it gonna erupt? Um, soon as, what are you saying? House gives me the queen. We might get in trouble. Uh, it makes me think to, it looks like there's zombies inside. There is no such thing as ghosts or zombies, he said. I, I know it just looks 
disgusting and old and breakable. And little Snooky inside the banana so it looks disgusting. It looks super disgusting. Hey guys, I thought you were there to stop a volcano. Yes, you said that I'm all about to find it. Do you need my help? No, Dino, that, you can see a dinosaur park. Miyako can handle this. <sighs> All right. I'm going to go against my better judgment on this one and trust that you guys can handle this on your own. If you need me, please don't hesitate to call me. I'll get over there ASAP. But you got to hurry up. Good luck, Dinosaur Patrol. Dino Dad out. Got it, Dino Dad. Dinosaur Patrol out. Kevin Tishman, it's a missing kit. Huh? Ready? L let's go. go. Nice and tenuous sense sand Oh yeah. Captain History, gotta read it so you can answer the question and activate the blast. Okay, here we go. Hi dinosaur patrol. It is time to solve the first question. Once you solve it, you will unlock the first unit of the special blast. First question what do Scientists believe to be the main driver of climate change. Hmm, that's a tough one, Captain Tasman. Do you think you can answer this? I, yes! Yes, Captain Coleman, I so do. I used to think it's smelly tacos. Huh? But it's actually carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide? Yep, that, that's, that's what caused it causes global warming. Okay, but you better wait your that in Dr. Taylor. This is Captain Chase Man, over. Hey Captain Chase Man, Dr. Madison's here. We did it, we answered the question. Great, what is it? The answer is carbon dioxide. Yup, you got it right Captain Chase Man. It is carbon dioxide. Let me punch it in. Yeah, we did it! Now there's two more to go. Yep, the first unit on the blaster should be activated. You got it, Dr. Captain Taylor. Captain Tasha Man out. Good job, Dinosaur Patrol. Two more to go. Okay, Captain Tasman, one unit is activated. Only two more to go. That's why right, Captain Come. Then we can blast that volcano. We just need two more to solve. And we have to find that if we want to activate that blaster. Oh, yeah. I think 
You should be the cold one. Hmm. Hi, Dinosaur Patrol. It's time to solve a math equation. Good luck, Dr. Madison Taylor. Second question. If we have ten tons too much, greenhouse gets in the atmosphere, but recycling gets rid of seven tons. How much greenhouse gas will it be? This seems like a really tough equation. Can you do this, Captain Coleman? Of course I can. Just give, just give me one minute. Because it's three tons. That's why Captain Coleman is. It's three tons of greenhouse grass. Okay, I'm gonna wait to win Dr. Madison Taylor. Where's that walkie talk? Here it is. Dr. Madison Taylor, this is called over. Dr. Madison here, do you have the answer, Coleman? I definitely got it right, Dr. Madison. It's three tons. You got it right, Captain Coleman. It is three tons. Let me come in. Okay, the second unit on the block here should be activated. Yay! Yay, we did it! Only, only one more question to go into me. Activate the blaster and destroy that volcano. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're gonna beat that volcano and save the Earth and save our dinosaur friends. Oh yeah. Okay, Dinosaur Patrol, just one more to go. We got the stock, the mouse and tail kept it coming out. Dr. Taylor, this is Captain Coleman. Over. Dr. Madison here. Do you have the answer, Coleman? Don Scott got it right. 
If the Earth changes its position every 40,000 40, years. Yup, that's right. The Earth changes its position every 40,000 years. All right, I'm punching in the final data. This should activate the blaster. Blaster's activated. It's now. Let's go stop that volcano now, Cole. Let's go. Good to hear Dinosaur Patrol. Now go stop that volcano. There it is. It's the volcano. I'm ready to shoot it and destroy it. I believe in you, Captain Chaseman. You can do this. I believe in you too, Cole. I'm your brother and you always cheer me up. Come on, come on, Chaseman. You can do this. You can do this. Dinosaur Patrol, the Dinosaur Institute for Kids, and all your dinosaur friends are grateful.